A couple of days ago, ChatGPT was updated with better math capabilities. I wanted to test out these capabilities, so I decided to give ChatGPT an Algebra 1 test, written by ChatGPT. Let's see how it did. Number 1, that's correct. Number 2, that's right. Number 3, that's right. Number 4, combined like terms? This just looks wrong. I don't know, I forgot how to do it, so I'll check. Okay, yeah, it was wrong. Number five is right. Number six? It can't draw graphs. I think it understands the problem, though. I guess I'll try to have it draw the graph. This isn't looking too good. I'll have it just plot the points. It puts the axis in the wrong place, but has good coordinates. I don't know, I feel like it should get credit because it's skills besides math it's failing at. A blind person would fail for not being able to draw a graph. I guess I'll give it half credit. Number 7. That's correct. Number 8. This looks complicated. Let me get some paper. Okay, I think it got it right. Number 9. Isn't this just x plus 2 times x plus 3? Am I missing something? I think it failed here. Last question. And now x plus 2 times x plus 3 is in the test question. If I was a teacher, I'd probably put all the answers inside the test like that just to see who notices. Anyway, it got it right. So overall, it got a 75%. A solid score will definitely get yelled at by its parents, but at least it got to move on to geometry and gets the opportunity to fail more tests. Stay tuned for how ChatGPT does on a geometry test, ChatGPT writes.